Adobe Spark, which is now called Adobe Express for video editing. Hello guys, Ilya here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we use Adobe Express to edit our videos. Basically it's pretty easy, just follow these tabs I do to not make any mistakes. So all we need to get started is just to visit adobe.com slash express. Basically uh, all you need to do is just to input in a search bar something like this, Adobe Express and then just click on enter. So we'll go to this page here, free online photo and design tool Adobe Express. Don't be scared, we also have the opportunity to create new videos. So on this page we need to click on get Adobe Express free and now we'll log into our account. Maybe you'll have to create one if you didn't have the previous version of your account. It will be possible for you to, you know, input your Google account and continue to use it like Google. So here is our interface. In the left side, we have our menu, home, projects, brands, libraries, schedule, and so on. On the home page, we also have some features we can do here. We have some templates. We have we can try quick actions here like with video editing or just with photo editing and also seasonal highlights with like some editing features. In the right top corner we have option for premium upgrade and also our account editing. So in order to start creating or editing our video we need to click on plus and as you can see, we have like a lot of stuff here. We can customize size, logger, flyer, college, and so on. So we also have like video editing. So in order to edit video, I suggest you to use this feature because on the other pages, you maybe won't be able to use some features. So let's click on our video and every great story star starts from somewhere. Tell us about your idea or title. You can always change it. So let it be like YouTube video. Click on next. And from here we can choose like pick a story template or start from scratch. So as you can see, uh, Adobe provides us some templates here and we can just claim simply choose something from here but I'll continue from scratch so I'll just choose start from scratch in the bottom of the screen so let's click it may take a little time to uh, you know go to editing page because this is like cloud service and it depends on your um, internet speed to like edit so now we are on our editing page and what do we have here in the top of the screen? We have option to preview, share or download. We can also add some teammates to edit with them. We have like layout folder, team, resize or music. In the right side, we have like options to work with our video with like how does it look like and so on. And in the bottom of the screen, we have uh, like our timeline or something like this. So as you can see, we have like some sends here. So let's delete them and like try to continue from scratch or maybe we'll not delete. So basically the first page here, we need to choose the first project and then just add something uh, to our like playground. So we'll just click on plus or just click on uh, for the background, we can click on plus and choose the necessary video. So I'd like to choose uh, this one from here. And I'll just click on open. Uh, so if your video is longer than the sun, we need to choose it the duration or the part we want to show. So I'd like to use this one and just click on save. So after that, it will be saved your our video clip basically. It may take a little time, so let's wait. And after that, we are able to continue. Now it looks like this. We can add some text or icon. So let's add text, which is called like rain forest. Yeah, so this is our basically first like sun here. We can also add like credits or we can add one more sun. So here we can add some other video or some other stuff. So we, simply we can just click on video. Choose it right up from here, for example. Also, choose the 
part we want to use. Let it be like this. And um, we can customize another parts of this video. So we can change. We can also add like video, photo, add some something like zoom in, zoom out. We can trim, we can add some stuff. And also we can add like text here, like, uh, you know, let it be like sunny weather. Let it be like this. So now it looks like, like this. So we can just simply, simply click on preview. And now we'll see the result of our like video editing. We can add the credits here if we need. Uh, so we can also like call to action, add call to action area or some other stuff. So this is about how can we deal with video. If you go to theme area, we can also add some stuff from here. We can find all of our works in projects area. So as you can see right up here. So we can simply go back uh, to edit all of our uh, videos. We can choose resize. We can resize it like widescreen or change the format of our video to like uh, squared size. We can go to music, add some music from their library. And after that, when everything is ready, we can simply click on download. So it's preparing for download now. And uh, in a few seconds, we'll be able to download the video from like Adobe Express. So as you can see, the process began. I won't export it. I want to show you some more features because as you can see, if you are clicking on plus, we can also add like uh, some quick features, quick, quick actions with video. So we can just stream, resize, merge, convert to GIF, crop, change speed, convert to MP4 or reverse video. So if you need only like to uh, do some actions from this, you can use this feature here to interact, to edit. And if we'll speak about the paid plans, uh, Adobe has also like premium version. They have like free and premium. So the differences is right up here in the premium. We have like uh, premium templates, uh, different fonts. We have the entire collections of royalty free Adobe stock collection photos, premium features like refine cutout, resize. We can plan and schedule our social media post. We can add our logo, convert and export to and from PDFs, share your templates, create on both web and mobile and the huge storage inside. So if you're interested in working with Adobe Express, I suggest you to like, of course, have the premium version. But basically, this is a way of how can we use Adobe Express for video editing. Hope this video helped you out. Please leave a like, comment and subscribe. I wish you a very good day. Goodbye.